everyone. It's Ann here from Ann Makes on YouTube and Ann Makes at AnnMakes.blogspot.com. And yesterday I went to Dollarama and Dollar Tree. I filmed the Dollarama haul already yesterday, but this morning I'm filming the Dollar Tree haul. And so yeah, stay tuned if you'd like to see what I got at Dollar Tree yesterday. They have these new 2018 calendars yes 2018 if you I know it's like five months away but you you know it'll be here before you know it and they're gonna have run out of calendars by the beginning of the new year <laughs> so I gotta jump on it I know but these make great gifts uh, around the uh, holiday season for or for New Year's Day so um, I just got one of each that they had. So this one is Love the Journey, uh, 2018 12 month calendar. I think they're all 12 month calendars that start in January. And this one has these designs in it. They're like a, a watercolor. And I got this one as well. Sorry about the glare. And how appropriate uh, I can hear the birds chirping. The real birds in my backyard chirping right now. As I'm showing you this calendar with lots of birds and butterflies. I just think uh, this, this is uh, my favorite one of the, the gang that I got. Another one that's like a watercolor theme it's a, a wild heart and free spirit quite lovely and these are the designs inside there was also this one the farmhouse kitchen it's a very like rustic countryish theme the colors are really pretty too with the this blue like teal blue and steel gray with the the wood look it's very very nice uh, and this one is beautiful bouquets this one is more like photographs of beautiful flowers and this is the back of it And this is the other one I got, uh, 2018, Let Your Light Shine. It's a very happy looking calendar. And the, each month, the back, very cute, very colorful, very bright. And they, I didn't, I believe it or not, I did not even take one of each of the uh, 2018, 12 month calendars that they had they there are other styles as well and uh, I just picked up all of these because I I just thought I, can't, I have I cannot justify buying every single one that they had and they also had some of these 12 month calendar the two packs where you get a smaller calendar with the big 12 month calendar and of course I had to get this one because it's a cat calendar as you know I really, I love animals, especially kitties. I got this, and here is a picture of the 12 months of kitty cats inside. <laughs> Very cute. Very cute. And then they have some that are more aimed for children. And uh, I have very big kids, but uh, I know that they still like Star Wars, so I got them each uh, a Star Wars calendar and this will go of course in their by their stocking it doesn't actually fit in the stocking but at, at Christmas time so and this is again the watercolor theme is very prominent even in the Star Wars so it's kind of neat and then this one because I know there are lots of people out there who are a big fan of hers and I am a fan of the art uh, made by the the company that it's licensed from 
so I, I thought I would buy this just to show you guys and just because I thought it, the artwork is really nice. It's Tink. Disney's Tinkerbell. I, I love uh, Walt Disney art and this one is all about Tinkerbell and it's just really, really pretty. I like how it's got this really modern twist to it. And for any Tinkerbell fans out there, uh, this would be a nice gift for them. So that is that for the very colorful calendars, as well as those wall calendars. Um, they has also put out the desktop um, monthly page planners that kind of you put on the top of your desk and you know you can you can write on this so what do you call these a desk blotter so I got this one for 2018 it's a nice size not too big they had some planners I they had some very colorful planners with some really nice designs on them and I uh, bypassed those but they're worth checking out because they're really pretty and but they're similar to this or the thin ones again every year they come out with these ones with the plastic covers and I just chose some in some uh, simple colors because I will be inserting these inside a, another binder for my own uh, system my own organization system and uh, these monthly planners you can see inside each day has lines across it so I, I like that for my my planning and there are a lot of uh, practical pages at the beginning with conversion tables and there's also the uh, executive planning guide, so I could see the whole year uh, in one glance. So I I will have one basically for my YouTube uh, videos, and I will have one for my blog posts, and I will have this one for other business. So these uh, my other business uh, obligations. So then I can combine them all into my big single planner but in here I keep all like the details for each assignment and post yeah very boring I know but <laughs> I gotta keep myself organized somehow um I got some of these portfolios I really like this print with the flowers and it says it's a two pack but I was a little disappointed because it's not two with the flowers uh, the other one is a really fun design as well. Uh, it's some triangles, and it's not my favorite, but that's okay. I'll, I'll definitely use it. I just would have liked to have two of the flowers. <laughs> but I understand that they want to put two different ones in the package to make it more interesting. So, yeah, but these, they're nice. They're really nice and thick, glossy cardboard um, for $1.25. By the way, I'm in Canada, so uh, the items at the Dollar Trees in Canada are $1.25. Uh, these are some folders, just some file folders with the tabs. It's another nice, pretty chevron print. And I also got this package of file folders. I'm pretty sure I've seen these a while ago, maybe even last year. They look familiar to me, but uh, my Dollar Tree had just put these out so and I really like the color so I got them and then I got this plastic like portfolio it's almost like see-through and it has two pockets inside just like the uh, cardboard ones but it's it's a really nice vinyl and I if I don't find a use for it as is. I might actually be able to cut this up to fit inside like my happy planner or my other smaller planners because you can cut this and it's just I just really like the effect the overlay effect that you can create with these vinyl clear vinyl folders. So moving on 
uh, Dollar, my Dollar Tree had, my Dollar Tree had put out several of these uh, Thermo Glow Gel Chafing Fuel. These burn for two and a half hours. They're basically a can uh, flammable gel that you use in camping. Uh, you could also use these in warming platters for a reception. Um, restaurants use this. And uh, these are also great if you want to make your own type of tabletop fireplace. Um, and yeah, so that's what this is. This is the fuel that is in those little tabletop fireplaces or warming things. And so $1.25 for this is such a good deal. Um, purchasing these at other stores, for us, we would have to go to Canadian Tire or maybe Walmart sometimes might have these. Uh, and they're a lot more than $1.25, so that's, that's a nice deal. Speaking of flammable things, I was in need of one of these long lighters because the other day... <laughs> We're not smokers, but we have some lighters in the house, but because we're not smokers, we've had the same lighter for years. <laughs> it was dead. And then I went to try matches, and they weren't working because they had gotten wet. So I said, you know, maybe it's about time I bought some firepower. So I got this at the Dollar Tree for $1.25. I purchased more of the adhesive magnet sheets that are six by nine inches. Uh, yeah, they're adhesive, so they do have like a sticker backing, so you can stick them to anything. You can cut these, you can die cut these, you can cut these with scissors, you can uh, do so many things. You stick them to the back of something and then you cut around it. There are multiple uses. I love to use these to organize my metal dies. And um, and actually, um, I saw Callie G was doing the same thing not too long ago, and I I do I do like her. Um, I've actually kept the plastic. I just cut it carefully so I can slide the sheet in and out, or I slot I s cut a slit here and I've hole punched it and put it in binders to store my um, my die cut my metal dies for die cutting. It's a great way not to lose all those little itty bitty pieces. I got some of the little birdies. They had put out different birdies and I thought these were really sweet looking. I got white ones with some shimmer. There's going to be many possibilities for crafting projects with this. These would look great on reefs. They would look great for Christmas decorations. They make great wedding decorations. You can put this on a gift. There's just so many uses for them. So, uh, and I got white, just white, because uh, I just didn't know what I would do with the other colors. And they had some beautiful bright colors, too, like blue and red. And, um, but I thought, no, nope, I'm just going to get the white for today. I also picked up two more of these little hanging jar thingies there with the juke cord by Dance and Decor. No, I haven't done anything with the other two that I previously hauled. because so I just haven't had the time. But, uh, I, I still, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with them but I just have to have them because I know I will come up with something eventually. And that eventually might be a year down the road, by the way. It could take me that long to figure it out. I found another scent of the uh, hand cream in the little tubes here. This one is the lavender. It smells so nice. Oh, so, so nice. I'm, I'm glad I oh, found this. I bought a couple packages of these metallic markers. Uh, I was waiting for my Dollar Tree to bring these out because uh, the ones I had were were dried up, well dried up. I used them, so I, I wanted some more. I also got silver and gold, so these are kind of a purple color, I guess, and blue. Well, more of a, ro a rose color, I guess like a metallic rose color and a light blue. And this one is purple and green. got one of these they call this a long reach and pickup 
sticky things, stick things like this. Dee, 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 dee. Yeah. Uh, because um, I, I, you probably cannot tell, but I am, I am uh, vertically challenged. So my arm length is also <laughs> vertically challenged. I'm short. That's what I'm trying to say. And I have short arms. And uh, I thought this would be would help me when I try to reach for things in the back of my car, <laughs> like in the trunk. I can't actually. I can reach into all the way back into the trunk without actually have to climb into the trunk. <laughs> That was the goal so because it kind of looks silly when you know I'm dressed nicely and then something I need has rolled back to the trunk back of my trunk so I thought this would be a little bit more graceful way of getting things out of my car I got the daisy pen I think it's such a lovely lovely pink pad they have Daisy they have Donald Duck I think they have Mickey Mouse too they had different um, characters I saw other people haul these and I had walked right by them the other day when I was at Dollar Tree but yesterday I said nope I'm going home with at least a daisy pen so of course a trip to the Dollar Tree for me uh, would not be complete without my purchasing a whole bunch of snacks so this time I got these pieces Pizel by Rico Vanilla Wafers. These are really yummy with a cup of coffee or even with ice cream and peaches. It's, it's, a, it's a really yummy little treat. Uh, this is tuna, Carlisle tuna, but it's not for humans apparently. <laughs> no way am I going to eat this. Uh, it's just, it says Carlisle, just tuna for cats. So it's a big can of tuna. Apparently just for Kitty and I will see if Kitty likes this. I thought this would be a nice treat for her. She is on a prescription uh, special diet. So uh, is she's costing me a fortune uh, with uh, her food, the food that she has to eat. So sometimes I still like to treat her with uh, some junk food because this basically this is junk food for the cat. So I got her that. I picked up the Mega Load Peanut Butter and Strawberry Jelly, like little cups. Got, I, I'm not planning on eating this, but I'm sure my boys will, will like it. Uh, Toad Alley Chocolates. I totally intend on eating these on the weekend. I really like to eat these when I watch a movie with my husband. That. Again, I and I got more than one this week because I'm not the only one who likes turtles. So I got some turtles for everybody to eat. We do love eating turtles, the chocolate ones. I got a few more of these jars of the peaches. They're very yummy, actually, and the jars are really cute after uh, you've eaten the peaches. And it's just a a good way to encourage everyone to eat more fruit uh, although we are buying more fresh fruit at this time of year because it's readily available uh, these are still fun to have for the rest of the year I got a few more of those something new to me uh, is this mac and cheese sauce mix uh, I will not be eating this because this is a no-no for me. There is way, way, way too much sodium in here for me to eat this. Plus, I don't even know if there's actually real ingredients in here. But I, knowing my teenagers, they will love this. I hope they'll love it. Apparently, you can sprinkle this on any type of pasta to turn it into mac and cheese. So they love mac and cheese, and we'll see if they like this. And if not, it was only a dollar twenty-five. Of course, we got another bag of Twizzlers. We love these things. And I picked what up this. My one of my sons really likes these cookies. They are the shortbread with fudge. They're very yummy. That's it for the snacks. Some other fun items. Uh, these are toys, but they will be turned into crafting projects. I got another reindeer. 
I made, oh, I actually found two this week, or this time, this visit to Dollar Tree. I found two more reindeer, so I got two more. It's gonna take me a while to get a, a whole herd of them, that's for sure. Um, I've been talking about doing some fairy garden thing, and I picked up this little fairy doll. Uh, not that I, I'm not crazy about the doll or itself, but I love her wings. So that is why I bought her. I'm not sure she's going to end up or how I'm going to put her in a garden or how I'm going to use her in mixed media. But maybe, I don't know. Maybe I will and maybe I won't. But I picked up this little fairy dolly. Uh, last, and it was four days before. Four days before I went to my Dollar Tree and they had a ton of these they had put out a ton of these little fairy fizzies and I had bought a few and then I did the the video and 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 also the unicorn and I did a video saying that I hauled these to put in a fairy garden and when I was there yesterday they barely had any left so I snagged up two more of each and Decorative little birds like this. I thought these were really cute to have to make some decorations for uh, all sorts of wreaths, home decor, even at Christmas time. Just sweet little birds. And this one, the bigger little birdie. Cute. And I got a package of the erasable highlighters. I saw, I think it was Sandra who hauled uh, these recently. And I, I wrote it on my list for my next trip because I have hauled uh, these last, I had last year. And I did like that they were erasable. So I was happy to see these again yesterday at my Dollar Tree. So I bought a package. And... Some uh, magnetic dry erase markers. These are great to put on the refrigerator. So when we're uh, writing our menu plan for the week, we use this with a board that we keep on the refrigerator so we know um, day to day what we're eating. And we, well, since we use, we use it, we had used up the markers we had, so I got new ones. I bought this container of bath salts that are rose scented and I, I gave it the sniff test and yes, they truly are rose scented and I, I can attest to that because right outside here, I have rose bushes and this, the scent that comes from these salt baths, bath salts, the scent that comes from these bath salts is very close to the scent emanating from my rose bushes. So kudos, Dollar Tree. Um, so it'll be nice in the middle of winter for me to take a soak in the tub and smell roses because I love, I love my roses. And I got this cute little pink uh, makeup pouch. Like that. I, just, I like the color. That's all I can say. I just liked it. I thought it was pretty. I bought this package of nails. I thought they were a really pretty uh, combination of colors and stripes. They look nice. The, and the teal has a little shimmer to it. It's hard to see there, but yeah, there's a little shimmer to the teal ones. Nice. I got the Vanilla Rose Scented Hand Cream. This smells so nice and the packaging is so cute. And I got the Vintage Rose one with the cute packaging. These make such lovely gifts to give to someone, you know, you could with the little pouch and the little cream. I think it's, it's a nice gift. Especially if you're going to visit someone in the hospital and I know personally, I go to the hospital, the air is dry sometimes, you know, and your skin gets, because the soap that they give you, 
is very drying. So this is a nice way to get some moisturizer and feel good. Um, vintage Rose body lo Hand and Body Lotion. Smells wonderful. Smells as beautiful as the packaging. Let me tell you, this, this is what I, I should be saying. Yeah, this too. Packaging is beautiful and the scent is beautiful. So, like that. Uh, this is just uh, advanced lubricating skin lotion for extra dry skin treatment. Uh, I'm running low on good body cream, so I'm hoping that I like this one. Especially, you know, when we have, you know, the rough elbows and the rough dry feet. And, um, yeah. So, you know, with a lot of walking around outside barefoot or in sandals, we get, you know, the very dry heels and stuff. So, uh, I'm hoping this will be helpful. And it, it has a nice scent, actually. So, I was pleasantly surprised. Uh, these uh, have just arrived at my Dollar Tree. The facial scrubbers, they're like this rubbery facial scrubbers. Uh, I got a few of these uh, for myself to try and also to give to my guys for, you know, exfoliating their own, their own skin and uh, dealing with acne. This might be helpful. So we'll try. We'll give these a try. Hopefully they will be helpful. If they're not helpful, uh, they're going to end up as a craft project. <laughs> and I have purchased these before and I did like using them. The microfiber facial pads. These are good also for uh, treatments, skin treatments. Those. There's a little spider in my bag. Did you come from Dollar Tree? I didn't buy you. I didn't pay for you, that's for sure. Uh, and finally, another body cream. Uh, this one in coconut. It smells divine. It smells like coconut. So this one will match a body wash that I have that is coconut. So I'll smell like a coconut. And that's that. That is that for my Dollar Tree haul uh, from yesterday. Uh, if you like this haul, I would appreciate a thumbs up and uh, like, comment, share. Please subscribe if you are already not already subscribed because I would love to get to 500 and maybe get do a giveaway. I don't know, just saying, just putting that out there. That would be fun. So uh, enjoy the rest of summer. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you after the next haul.